Children very frequently get colds, but a lot of parents will also notice that children may be mouth breathing, they may be even snoring. And a lot of times we just ignore it as something which all kids get. Now that may be true, but some of these children may also have more complex conditions. In fact, they may even have something called obstructive sleep apnea. Hello, I'm Dr. Shantanu Tandon, the head of department and senior consultant in ENT at Sakra World Hospital. And I'll tell you a little bit more about how to pick up on such problems. Now, whenever we see young children, now we're talking about three-year-olds, four-year-olds, six-year-olds, uh, apart from frequent colds, they may often sleep with their mouth open. They may have a very restless pattern of sleep. They may be very irritable through the day. And sometimes we're not very sure why this is happening. If you're not able to sleep well, if you're not getting a good quality sleep, you are going to be irritable. And obstructive sleep apnea is one of the things which can cause this. This is very common in older adults but it is often missed in young children. And the most important thing is this is most likely caused by either an enlarged tonsil, an enlarged gland called adenoids, and sometimes even something as simple as very frequent allergies and colds. There are solutions to all of these things, but the important thing is to have a high index of suspicion and make sure a child is not just treated continuously with medical treatment, but get, gets evaluated either by testing their sleep patterns or meeting an ENT who can look into these small spaces in the nose and throat and see whether they're obstructed. Sleep apnea can be dangerous because it can decrease the amount of oxygen that the child is getting and therefore make the child more prone to other medical problems. But unlike adults, children may not be able to tell us what is happening and why it is happening and therefore they just act out. So it's one of those things which we should keep in mind and focus on. Thank you.